द स्टोरी टेक प्लेस इन रोम वेयर अ ग्रीक स्लेव नेम्ड एंड्रियो किल्स स्केप्ट फ्राम हिज मास्टर एंड फ्लैट इन टू द फॉरेस्ट दे आर ही वंडर्ड फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम एंडल ही वॉज वेरी एंड वेल नाई स्पेंड विद हंगर इन डिस्पेयर जस्ट दैन ही हर्ड अ लाइन नियर हिम माउनिंग एंड ग्रोनिंग एंड एट टाइम्स रोरिंग टेरिबली टायर्ड एज ही वॉज एंड्रिकल्स रोज अप एंड रश्ड अवे एज ही थाट फ्रॉम द लॉयन बट एज ही मेड हिज वे थ्रो द बुशेज ही स्टम्बल ओवर द रूट ऑफ अ ट्री एंड फेल डाउन लेम्ड वेन ही ट्राइड टू गेट अप देयर ही सॉ द लॉयन कमिंग टूवर्ड्स हिम लिम्पिंग ऑन थ्री फीट एंड होल्डिंग हिज फोर पा इन फ्रंट ऑफ हिम एंड रिकल्स वॉज इन डिस्पेयर ही हैड नो स्ट्रेंथ टू राइज एंड रन अवे एंड देयर वॉज ए लॉयन कमिंग अपॉन हिम बट वैन द ग्रेट पीस्ट केम अप टू हिम इंस्टेड ऑफ अटैकिंग हिम इट कैप्ट ऑन मॉर्निंग एंड लुकिंग एट हिम ही सॉ द लॉयन वॉज होल्डिंग आउट हिज राइट पा इट वॉज कवर्ड विद ब्लड एंड मच सोलिन लुकिंग मोर क्लोजली एट इट एंड रिकल्स सॉ अ ग्रेट बिग थॉर्न प्रेस्ड इन टू द पा विच वॉज द कॉज ऑफ ऑल द लॉयन्स ट्रबल Plucking up courage, he seized hold of the thorn and drew it out of the lion's paw, who roared with pain when the thorn came out. But soon after, found such relief from it that he fawned upon Andricles and showed in every way that he knew to whom he owed the relief. Instead of eating him up, he brought him a young deer that he had slain, and Andricles managed to make a meal from it. For some time, the lion continued to bring the game he had killed to Andricles, who became quite fond of the huge beast. One day, a number of soldiers came marching through the forest and found Andricles. As he could not explain what he was doing, they took him prisoners and brought him back to the town from which he had fled. Here, his master soon found him and brought him before the authorities. Soon, Andricles was condemned to death for fleeing from. His master now it used to be the custom to throw murderers and other criminals to the lions in a huge circus so that while the criminals were punished the public could enjoy the spectacle of a combat between them and the wild beasts so andricles was condemned to be thrown to the lions and on the appointed day he was led forth into the arena and left there alone with only a spear to protect him from the lion the emperor was in the royal box that day and gave the signals for the lion to come out and attack andricles but when it came out of its cage and got near andricles what do you think it did instead of jumping upon him it fawned upon him and stroked him with its paw and made no attempt to do him any harm it was of course the lion which andricles had met in the forest the emperor surprised at seeing such a strange behavior in so cruel a beast summoned andricles to him and asked him how it happened that this particular lion had lost all its cruelty of disposition so andricles told the emperor all that had happened to him and how the lion was showing its gratitude for his having relieved it of the thorn thereupon the emperor pardoned andricles and ordered his master to set him free while the lion was taken back into the forest and let loose to enjoy liberty once more